Welcome back friends. Today we are going to solve lead code problem 1791 find center of star graph. There is a undirected star graph consisting of n nodes labeled from 1 to n. A star graph is a graph where there is one center node and exactly n minus 1 edges that are connected the center node with every other node. You are given a 2D integer array edges where each edge i is from ui to vi indicates that there is an edge between the node ui and vi return the center of the given star graph so as you can see this is the one example they have given us and you can see 2 is the center as you know visually we can see it here so let's just take this same example here and we'll discuss how we can solve this problem so uh n is Actually, given is number of nodes in the graph, right? So in this case, n is four, right? There are total four nodes, one, two, three, four. So what we are going to do is we are going to iterate through the edges that they have given us. So they have given us these edges. So we will iterate through the edges and we will create a hash map from that, right? So uh, for example, hash map will have a key and value pair, right? So let's just have one hour. Uh, hash map here for example okay so let's say there is a h 1 to 2 so 1 to 2 we will say there is the entry uh, so 1 is one of the node that we found in this 1 to 2 entry so we will mark it as a 1 and 2 is also one of the 1 to 2 right so source and destination we will mark as 1 1 as a count right here so that's how we will uh, do it and uh, we will take another edge here so 1 to 2 we are done right so 1 to 2 we have done now let's take uh, 2 to 3 right so 2 to 3 is another edge so we will again read it uh, from and to value from the edge so from is let's say 2 right so we will increment the count of 2 here because 2 is already there so we will make it 2 here and 3 is not there so we will add entry of 3 1 here right okay so after that we are uh, we have to consider this last edge which is a 2 to 4 again we will check if entry for, for the node 2 is there then we find the entry we will increment it by 1 so it becomes 3 4 there is no entry so we will add one more entry here for the 4 so after we are so now we are done with all the edges right so we will we have our hash map ready now so we will iterate through the hash map and we will check if any entry has a value uh, one less than the number of nodes which is number of nodes is 4 here so we are checking for the value which is 4 minus 1 which is 3 right so 3 entry we will check into the hash map and we will find this entry because 2 has the entry 3 right so that's how we will decide that the 2 is actually center of the this star graph so let's just quickly discuss this implementation here. So as uh, you know, as I mentioned, we will create a map here. So we define the hash map here of integer comma integer, and n is not given to us directly. So we just took n as zero number of nodes, and as we iterate through the edges here, we will keep track of the maximum number of. Uh, uh, you know we find actually during this iteration so maximum is 4 so we will get n as 4 here so this is nothing but we are just reading each each edge here and we are getting a from and to from this array e0 e1 and then we are just either it either making an entry into the map a new entry here if it's not there or we will just update the entry here by one right so we will do it for both from and uh, to so there are two cases here, right? from node and to node. So we, we have to do it for both the cases. And at this end of the loop here, we are actually populated our hash map and we will iterate the hash map here. And we will just check, you know, if the value that we get for the node in the hash map, if it is equal to n minus one, then that is our answer. That is the center of the graph R. And we will just return the R here. So I took uh, the two examples they have given us here. So these are the first two examples and I created one another example 1, 3, 2, 3. So 
so for example in this last example as you can see 3 is the center of the graph because it is connected from both 1 and 2 so let us just quickly run this code so the code is working fine so <coughs> uh, it's giving the correct answer so let's just submit the code yeah so the code got accepted so um, this is how we can find you know the uh, center of star graph so here uh, we are actually just like iterating one through all these edges and we are just creating the hash map so uh, you know like uh, you can say that it's just like order of n because we are iterating and creating the uh, hash map from that edges so that's the solution for this problem if you like this video click on the like button and subscribe to my channel uh, i often place I, I often uh, put videos regarding you know java j2 interview questions and leap code solutions so if you are related to this uh, stuff you know uh, subscribe to the channel so you won't miss any further notification thanks for watching